the new Shopify Sober Editions is out and there are over 100 new features and updates. This time they are focusing heavily on AI tools to make it easier to create, market and run your store. But they also added new free official apps that expand the functionality of your Shopify store and allows you to sell in more places and in more ways. Hey guys, it's the Econ Bull here and in this video I'm going to show you the best and most useful Shopify new features. So let's get started in three, two, one. All right, so I'm going to divide this into three categories. New Shopify official apps, visual and theme updates, and finally, AI. So let's start with one app that I have been expecting for a long time, and it is the Shopify Bundles app. You can now create and sell bundles with Shopify, one of the best ways to increase your average order value. And it works for fixed bundles and also for multi-packs. And this is a big deal, but let's check out the screenshots. So you can create the bundle and select the products that you want to include. You can add products with options. So if you have a clothing store and you want to offer a bundle with t-shirt, pants and also shoes, you can allow them to select the size of each one of the products as a variation. And this is how it is displayed, so you can choose the variation of each one of the products that are contained in the bundle. So yeah, looks pretty cool, but let's try it out. Oh no, a bundle can't have more than 10 products, 10 bundle options or 100 variants. That sucks. So I have this product with seven different sizes and this product with another seven different sizes. So seven times seven and then this one times seven again, that's going to be 343 variants. All right. So I contacted Shopify about this limit and they say that they are working on increasing the limit to 250 variants, which, you know, it's not even that many, but just to try this out, let me just reduce some of the sizes. Yeah, it's not even going to work. So let me actually just put all the sizes, but remove one of the products. All right, so two products with all the sizes. Save and continue. Now let's create the bundle page and I don't want to write the entire description. So I'm just going to use Shopify magic to make it for me. All right, we got our description. Let's keep it. Now we have all of the variations right here and there's so many of them. So to put the price, let's just make it very simple. Let's just apply to all done. And there we go. So we can select whatever size we want independently on each one of the products. Awesome. So this has its limitations right now, but it works if you have products with variations, but not that many of them. Now the next new app is Shopify Collectives and they are trying to connect all of the stores with this. So you can sell other people's products on your website. And the same way people can sell your products on their website. Collective is an effortless new way for Shopify stores to connect and sell each other's products. So basically you go to the Shopify Collectives app and select the products that you want to add on your store. Let's say that you are a yoga brand, right? And you sell yoga clothes, but you think that your audience is going to also like yoga mats. So you find a good company that sells yoga mats and then you add their products to your website. And if someone buys them, that order goes directly to the other store so they can ship it and you get a cut. So each store will upload to Shopify collectives the products that they want other stores to sell and also the price of the product and the margin that they are willing to give away. And typical margins are 20 to 40 percent. Now, these are the requirements if you want to add products to your store. So you have to be in the US and sell in dollars. Also, you have to have Shopify payments activated and also made at least $50,000 in the last 12 months. And if you want your products on other people's stores, you have to have the same requirements, but also be active on the shop app and meet shop merchant guidelines. So I just sign up for the waitlist and I will make a video with a full review of this product once I get access to it. And finally, we have an official Shopify subscription app. So you can create a subscription plan, choose the products and allow people to buy them as a subscription. You can choose if you want weekly delivery or monthly delivery and you can give a discount if they choose a subscription plan. But you will also allow them to just buy once 
with the regular price. This one is also on early access, but if you need a subscription app right now, I do have a video where I show you another app for subscriptions that is amazingly good and it's free until you make at least $500 per month and then it's super cheap. So you can try that one. By the way, if you don't have Shopify yet or you're making a new store, check out the link that I have on the description where you will get a free trial and also a few months for only $1 per month. Now let's take a look at the visual updates. So all free themes now have built-in support for theme animations, including fading on scroll, special effects for image banners, and hover effects on cards and buttons. So if you're using a free theme, make sure that you update it. So just go to your themes page and click on add to theme library when you see the update. Then go to customize, then go to the theme settings, go to animations, and you can activate the animations from there. Now another super cool update is the flex section. So now you can customize your sections however you please. So you can simply just drag and drop, resize, group, move around. So each section could be unique. Now let's move to AI because the big star of the show is this new AI assistant called Sidekick. It's basically an overpowered chatbot that lives inside of Shopify. And you can ask it questions like, why did I have a sales drop from March to now? And it will tell you because there was minimal snow. So you can ask it, okay, just put everything on sale. And there you go, it creates a sale on each one of your products. So before you will have to navigate the Shopify admin and do it manually, but now you can just say what you want and they will do it. Like check out this example, add my new surf collection to my homepage. And there you go, it just adds the collection. Now it's summer and you don't want to sell snowboards anymore. So you ask him, remove my snowboard collections and make my store look like a surf shop. And also write new content for my hero banner focus on selling surfboards. And it just does it in seconds instead of hours like it would normally take you. So this one is also an early access and only a few people can use it. I'm not one of them. But as soon as I can get my hands on this, I'm gonna make a full review. So subscribe if you want to see it. Now, speaking about AI, I want to show you the sponsor of today's video, Tiny Einstein. This app automates your entire email marketing. When you install it, it's gonna ask you to choose a layout, set up a ton of voice, and also write a little bit about your company and your products. And from there, AI takes care of everything else because it will create a series of email newsletters for all the special holiday occasions and special events. Each newsletter will feature a product or a discount or a collection and the copy is generated by GPT-4 and it will match your brand's tone of voice. And email marketing is cheap to send, but it gets a lot of conversions. However, it takes a lot of time to create all of these newsletters, but this app does it for you. So I'm leaving the link in the description with a special coupon code if you want to check it out. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm out.